me go beast on no. I go beast Go deep, I OD on no. I OD Apply pressure, put heat on no. Put that Five heat. zero zero degrees on no. Five hundred degrees Go dumb, me go beast on no. I go beast Go deep, I OD on no. I OD Apply pressure, put heat on no. Put that Five heat. zero zero degrees on no. Five hundred degrees Count down, levitate uh, uh. Go and what up, elevate. YouTube? Cart Sin Cruz here with the Ice Out Snowflake, Mr. Victor Oladipo, loaded up with badges, including Hall of Fame clamps and range extended, a bunch of other good shit. I got the stats on the screen here, 95 steel and perimeter defense looking good, 93 speed, speed with ball, and 92 acceleration, 97 vertical, 96 lap quick. Oh man, why do you just give these cars a 99.7? We also got this new ball here, super cheesy with no badges, I don't know man. Yeah, it feels like they they might have had enough of the bitching about George Marathon and uh you know they made, brought this curve down to earth. He's got a good post game, seventy something three ball, ninety seven interior defense, ninety five ninety eight on the rebounding. Uh yeah, he's got good hustle, ninety five stamina, not terrible. We also got this uh, snowflake Doug Christie, who hey, he's always one of my favorite budget cards to play with in the game. Decent speed, so um, ball control, all that good stuff. He's a lockdown defender. Uh, that's about it, though, man. Some of these budget cards, man, this set today kind of feel to me, it feels like today was going to be prime Kobe day. And with all these stupid-ass comments and, and remarks and feedback, 2K My Team was getting on Twitter about releasing a Kobe and profiting from it, which... You know, I know it's, it might not be the right time, but it's like a conflicted story here where everybody either wants to play with the card or they want 2K to give it to us for free or they think they should just drop an Evo card, whatever. I feel like this set was just thrown together today to, uh, you know, take the place of Kobe. There's a couple Laker greats in this set. And, uh, yeah, I think, I think we just kind of got it last minute. These cards were probably built in the first of the year, a lot of them. Uh, and they just didn't, and Victor Old Depot just came back up. That's why he's getting a card, because, you know, he hasn't been able to play most of the year. He's back now, but anyway, we're going to start this gameplay off. It just, I, mean, I don't know, it doesn't really matter. You either, you know, everybody wants to play with the Kobe, but they don't want 2K to make money from it. But, you know what, guys, we got this set today. So we're going to go over to Victor Old Depot and try to ball. Look at the passing from Old Depot, the ball movement. <laughs> Man, Galaxy Open Penny just makes everything a lot easier. Doug Christie here. Driving in on the Diamond LeBron, flicking it back to Oladipo. Depot! Oh! Go deep! Oh, Depot, no! That's what I'm talking about. Throwing it down on that Diamond LeBron, bro. We need a new LeBron card, man. I'm ready. Oh, my God. Penny Hardaway saucing up Kobe. Corner. Ah! Oh! This is what happens when you don't have any freaking shooting badges, Doug Christie. But anyway. <laughs> We block down there, but Embiid picks up the loose ball and scores. Like happens most of the time. Anyway, Penny, goddamn dude, this Penny is amazing, bro. He's the best dribbler getting to the river in the game. Like just like for a big point guard, man. Just uh, -uh. but new ball with the contest there on LeBron. Oh, the depot picks up the board. We're pushing it. Penny, give a little hezzy up and under on Luka Doncic, man, bro. We need, that's another card we need. We need a Luka Doncic that has clamps, bro. Because this Luka Doncic point guard card right here is getting took into town by this Galaxy Opal Penny. He's already got seven. Oladipo with two, two, and two. Nice move by Kobe. Signature fade right there. I like that. One more look at that. Tatum late closing out on it. No good. Green light Kobe. It's 13 to four, I believe. Oladipo trying to sauce. Finds Penny open in the corner. Just a little late, Kobe. This Penny don't miss. Getting it up. Pushing it. Tatum over to Hardaway. Damn, we tried to hit Depot in the corner, but Josh Smith, the great defensive card, is over there to snag the baited steal. And Kobe all the way to the rim. Let's go. Got a good matchup on our hands right here. Close one here in the first quarter. Minutes to go. Oh, my God. Penny hits Tatum, but Tatum was fair. He's going to get blocked from behind. Gives it up. Back to Penny. Splash. Why don't do Penny? Penny is balling, bro. 10 points already for Penny. Why not make it 13, bro? Holy shit, Penny just broke ankles right there. Let's go. Oh, man. Old Depot got took there by Kobe. That's all right. We're going to inbound it here. Old Depot's got it. Bringing it up. Over to Penny Hardaway. 
Oh my god, he just dunked on Embiid, dude. Embiid, how's, how's my dick taste, bro? How's my dick taste? Come on, man. No one can stop this Penny. Penny working on Josh Smith. Gonna hit him with the post fade. Fake! Doug Christie over the corner. Jason Tatum green light. Dude, that was some freaking impressive ball movement right there. Galaxy Opal Penny running the show. Got the shot creator takeover. We got Oladipo locking Kobe in the corner over there. You can't throw the ball to Kobe right now. You're gonna have to dribble LeBron. But Doug Christie, let's go! Forcing the turnover. And man, man, dude, just clamps all over the court. We locked that up in the corner there. We got our bench in now. Brandon Roy. Oh! Oh! <coughs> oh my god. That was fun. That was nuts, bro. Roy dribbling it up here. The trail spree will diamond on him. And yeah, he broke. Slide on those skates, man. Very easy lay in there on Tim Duncan. And yeah, 36-23. Third quarter, 2.36 to go. Oladipo trying to sauce up this Doncic. Doncic gets a steal. How about that? The one good defensive rating Doncic has. He gets a steal. Nice. LeBron able to finish Doug Christie late. Close out there. Hits a three there. Another three for LeBron. I'm so ready for a new LeBron card, though. Because that diamond was good at the beginning of the year, bro. So he's going to have an amazing card. Pink diamond. Donovan Mitchell. Uh, this is the card right here that's giving me a hard time. Like, wanting to keep this Oladipo. Like... I know Oladipo, like, has the purple defensive badges, but, like, if you look at Donovan Mitchell's stats, like, he has, like, 92, 93, 95 on all defensive stats that matter for shooting guard, point guard. Uh, dude, Donovan Mitchell's locked down, and he's, I mean, he might not, he might not rate much better on all, on defensive ratings, but, like, the, like, I mean, on offense, like, but he's, like, you know, dude is amazing, so. Uh, I love the Donovan Mitchell. I don't know which one I'm going to keep yet, Oladipo or Donovan Mitchell, but, you know, i got to make a decision. I'll probably sell Oladipo back if he's still going for around 33k. I just want to pay for him, so if he's going for that, I'll probably sell him back. Try to scoop him later for mid-20s. Uh, but, yeah, we got Donovan Mitchell here. We've got Kobe guarding him. Donovan trying to give him the sauce. Oh, yeah, he just did. Oh, he did. Oh, yeah, he did. Pulled those brakes. Russell Westbrook, easy getting to the rim. 9.3 seconds left. And we're, we're starting to pull away here again. 46-33. Donovan Mitchell. Kobe. Kobe! Oh, my God. You ran into the big block of cheese. Manute Bowl over there. Start of the fourth quarter. We got to get we got to get our boy Oladipo back in. But, like, this Donovan Mitchell, man. If you guys haven't tried this Donovan Mitchell, he's a very similar card to that Kobe Bryant, but he can play point guard. Both of them are. And, uh, yeah, I, I mean, so Donovan Mitchell, Oladipo, Go look at the stats. Compare them to J.R. Smith glitch that goes for 300K. These cards are just as good, if not better, than J.R. Smith. And, bro, they're 30K. Like, why would you ever pay 300,000 MT for J.R. Smith when you could have Oladipo or Donovan Mitchell for 30K? It just doesn't make sense to me. Oladipo, let's go. Posting up Luka Doncic like a madman. Oladipo got Luka on him again. Trying to give him the dribble sauce. He's blinking, though. Oh my god, here we go. Get it back to him. Let's go! Step back! Oh! Damn, man. I thought we had him. Jokic gets the board. Over to Oladipo. Nice pass up to Bird. Bird can't hang on to it. Picks it back up. Hits Depot. Come on, let's give it to him. Tries to hit that post spin. And that uh, breaks it. Man, dude, like these cards. Like, I sent him out for, like, midway through the third, all the way to midway through the fourth. And he's still blinking. Like, the stamina in this game is just fucking ass, bro. Depot on the free throw line. We got six, seven points, two rebounds, four assists so far. I mean, dude, this is a solid game, man. My, my, my shooting guard has become my facilitator because Penny Hardaway and Russell Westbrook Pink Diamond, they just, like, fuck everybody up, basically, and score points, and especially Penny. With his, you know, 90-something three ball. You know, oh, Oladipo! Oh, my God. He just fucking embarrassed LeBron, even though he missed the layup. LeBron got caught with his pants down there, dude. That was a pretty sweet move. I'm not going to lie. I'm liking this Oladipo. I'm going to buy him back, but I'm gonna have to, I think I'm going to have to sell him. Green light, Oladipo. Woo! 38 seconds to go, 56 to 43. This Oladipo is balling, man, but look, I, I'm highlighting this right here. Because Depot got 56 stamina right now. And I played him, you'll see here. I played I played him for um 
Well, switch. I played 13 minutes with the Solo Depot. 11 points, 2 rebounds, 5 assists, 1 turnover, 4 of 10, 1 of 2, 2 of 2. I mean, like a very great game. He had 2 dunks, but like no stamina to come back in and play in like the last 3 or 4 minutes of the 4th quarter. Like, like, I mean, they took away the behind the back. Give us some stamina to at least make it through a game with. Like, I get we need, you know, there's 13 slots. But, like, we want to play with the cards that, um, you know, the new cards, like, when they come out. Like, we don't want to, we don't want to bench them the whole, like, half the time. I mean, yeah. So, I mean, I played 13 to 20 minutes. And, you know, I mean, if I did a crossover, I was blinking, which is just sad. It's just really sad. And uh, it makes me mad, but you know, what, what do you do? What do you do? Nothing you can do about it. But anyway, yeah, I mean, just, just keep going here. I mean, this is, you know, it is what it is. There's nothing we can do about it. Like, we can't make, we can't change, we can't change this. You just gonna have to deal with it. So, uh, yeah, I mean, see, Donovan Mitchell played four minutes, four points. I mean, like, yeah, he was solid. Manu Ball, you know, he played good. I played him 12 minutes. He did fine. I mean, like, I didn't try to run any pick and fades with him, but I, he did set a lot of nice screens. Uh, he doesn't have brick wall though, so like, kind of pointless. Um, I'll probably sell the minute ball too. Now that I think about it, like, it, I mean, stupid me put like a AK diamond shoe on him uh, to help him be stronger because he has like 26 strength. But anyway, I shot well. Like I've been struggling with my shooting. I shot. 5-9, 56% from 3, 68 from the field, 5-5 five five from the free throw line. Dude, look at offensive rebounds. Like, I won that game easily. Like, not even, like, putting the pressure on the dude. On ball the whole game, and he picked, beat by 13. But he got 17 offensive rebounds to my two. Um, Manu Bowl, bro, where, where are you at on the offensive rebounding, man? Like, how, how do you gonna let that happen? Like, how do you use Manu Bowl for the first time ever and give up 17 offensive fucking rebounds, bro. That is, just, that is nonsense. Like, how, how does that even happen, Manu? Mm, sell your ass, too, here pretty soon. I mean, you go for a lot anyway, so... Uh, yeah, it'd be nice to sell you and uh, get some MT back, because definitely overpaid for your ass. Once everybody... Once you're exposed here, how sorry you are at rebounding. Uh, yeah, then... Uh, you know, freaking pay too much for your ass. But anyway... Let's kind of take a look here at what Oladipo is selling for. And, uh, oh, yeah, that's not the diamond. <coughs> there we go. We got diamond on there now. Let's see if he's going. Hopefully he's going for like 35K and I just won't, you know, I'll break even or lose a thousand MT for getting to try him out, which is fine. I'm fine with that. <coughs> <clears throat> oh, sweet. He's going... The cheapest up is 36K for Oladipo. I mean, he has 16 Hall of Fame badges and 24 gold. So, I mean, like, he's a nice, very nice card. Uh, but, clearly, like, stamina. He doesn't... He, he can't do it. So, yeah, I mean, so you got... I mean, I'm running him at the two. But, like, passing through him a lot, you know, because I like to um, shoot off the catch with uh, Penny because he has Hall of Fame catch and shoot difficult shots. Uh... And it's Penny, and I just, you know, I like I like catching the ball of space with him. But, yeah, we'll just see if this Ola Depot can sell. And, uh, I don't know. I mean, like, dude, it's a great budget card. And, and I'm probably going to pick it back up and run it on my budget squad. Uh, it's, when is 25K MT in a day or two, or to later today even. But anyway, that's the gameplay for today. Like, comment, subscribe. Cards and Crows. Peace. Levitate, going up, elevate, watch me demonstrate, on time, never late, I grind, celebrate, no pump fake, hesitate, I have been scoring every day, champagne, Perrier, since 9-3, been in the box, now I'm stepping up tone, like straight out the sandlot, now I'm plotting on the globe, I work hard, I show love, that karma steady grind.